Okay, now we need to create another part for our dragster assembly that we're creating. The part we need to create now is going to be the washer that's going to hold our axles onto our dragster and on our wheels. So I'll go out here to the dragster template I created, which is like the Platt Custom template, except that I've gone ahead and set it to inch pound second in four decimal places in the ANSI standard for my drafting standard. Okay, it comes up. Just to reiterate that, it's already set to millimeter gram scale. I go to my document units, it's already set to four uh, decimal places, which is all good. I'll go with that. Now, again, I always set myself to the right plane. You do that. And now we're going to draw our washer. So I'll come out here to my sketch, and I'll open up the uh, sketch command, and I'll draw a washer in here. And the washer that I'm going to draw is about 3 eighths of an inch in diameter, so I'll go ahead and set that to 3 eighths. Remember, SOLIDWORKS is bilingual. So we're going to say 3 slash 8, double quote, and we'll hit enter. And of course that comes in and says 9.525 is our diameter. Now I do know the diameter of a in millimeter of a quarter inch uh, axle, so I'll go ahead and set that distance there, and I'll key in that size, and that's going to be 3.175 of an inch, and there it is. Okay. So now I've got my artwork and my design laid out for my washer. And while I'm still in the feature, if while I'm still in the sketch, I can go to features and I can do an extrude. And as you can tell, it, just, it tries to extrude it out to, or propose to extrude it out to 10 millimeters. And that's a big washer. We're going to say it's one millimeter. So we'll come back to that. Actually, I'm going to make it a little smaller than that. I'm going to say 0.75 of a millimeter. And we'll place it in there as such. Now you can go measure a washer, but you know, you're going to get washers and stuff from a variety of different vendors, and also there'll be different types. Brass is a good choice, so we're going to go ahead and make this one brass, and we'll just do a right mouse click on our edit material, and we'll come down here and select brass. And so it selects brass, and that looks pretty good. Now, if I want, I can come over here to my appearances, and I can click on this, I can go to metal, and I can come down here and click on brass, and they'll show me a variety of different brass. Uh, uh, brass looking type uh, uh, textures that I could put on my actual drag strip. I'm going to go with the brushed one. It seems to look a lot like that, so I'll drag it over here and put it on brush. Okay, that looks pretty good. So now we'll go ahead and save this as, I hit save, and we're going to call this brass washer. Already made one already, so I'm going to say brass washer uh, 001. Hit enter, and there it saved my file. Good. We'll stop here for now and come back and design a bushing that's going to go on my dragster.